Hey y'all, it's me Zoe here at Zoe's World and I am happy to be back today for another Timu haul as well as the 12 days of Christmas drawing. Okay, what is today? Today is the 5th, so it is day 5 of the 12 days of Christmas. Y'all, I can't keep track. But let's jump first in with our Timu haul. Let's get it done. I got four small bags in and so it's it's a good size haul just because there were there were I don't know anywhere from I'd say five to seven items in each each little bag so we'll go ahead and jump in and see what we got here okay the first item was nine dollars and thirty cents y'all it came all smashed like this <laughs> most of the time when this happens it is okay you know depending on what the item is um, but I haven't taken it out yet, so we're going to take it out. This is a tripod, and this is one of the many things that I have purchased for my office. Oops, and I'm dropping stuff. Okay. For my office for filming for you guys. So there's a bunch of little attachments here, it looks like. And I'm just going to kind of... Some instructions. Oh, here's the camera remote control. That's very cool. This is the attachment to put your phone in here on the tripod. I did drop one little piece. Let me grab it. Uh, another attachment for the phone to go in. And let's see here. Comes in this nice little case. So that's nice to keep it protected. Let's go ahead and take it out and see how how the quality is y'all it's got a good weight to it so that's exciting because i've had a tripod before but it just didn't run out hold the phone up very well here's the tripod it's not super huge which i'm excited about too because my office is so tiny and then it's got this is the extender where everything connects y'all i think this is going to work out great super excited about it i'm surprised at all the attachments that came with it because i was not aware of that so that's another excitement because I'm thinking that it might actually work out better than I even realized. So yes, y'all, this is the tripod that I got for filming for the office. I'm off today, y'all, and tomorrow. And then I work on Thursday, and then I'm off Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So you guys know me. I love my days off. Okay, guys, I'm not going to attempt to put this back in here while I'm on camera. I'm just going to sit to the side. Okay. Next item. This is $4.49. I had already showed you guys these. I want to say it was in the last Timu haul. They're just little floral picks that have the berries and stuff on them. Um, they are, some people call them frosted or flocked. I'm not going to take them out of this bag because the last couple times I did that with the flock stuff, I had stuff everywhere in my car. So, they're just little floral picks. You've seen them before in the other video. I just got some more. I wanted to make sure I had plenty to kind of stick in different places of my house. Okay. This next item was $1.88. Now, as y'all can see, I straightened my hair today. I don't do this real often. I didn't actually, well, I guess I did straighten it because it's, my hair is just so thin as I'm getting older and it's a frizz ball. And I feel like when I straighten it, it looks even thinner. You guys will have to let me know what you think. But um, I used to always use a flat iron. I still use one once in a great while if I want a certain look. But I've got one of those heated brushes. Y'all, it is like the greatest thing ever. It is so much easier than using a flat iron. And as you can see, this came in the same bag as the flocked floral picks I just showed you. And you can see the flock stuff actually came out of the bag onto this. Which it, it should just come off of there. But that just shows you how bad that stuff gets everywhere. Something to know if you don't want that stuff in your house. <laughs> okay, now what this is basically is it is to sit your curling iron, stuff like that on to protect the surfaces. It's a heat mat. And I like that it's got this little hanging thing to hang it up with. I, I mean, I don't, I guess that's what it's for. You guys let me know. It just has this little, I don't know. <laughs> I see very cool okay guys let me explain to you what it what that little thing is it's not to hang it up good thing they gave directions they don't always on Timu I'm just gonna kind of put it up here to kind of show you so if hopefully you guys can see it basically you wrap it around the curling iron or hot iron whatever it is you're using 
And that little hoop, that open hoop, will wrap around it to keep it shut. Hope that makes sense. Okay, so that's what I got this for. The hot items in my for my bathroom. Okay. This next item was eleven dollars and ninety eight cents. This is actually a vlogging kit, and I picked this up. Um, I'm not gonna take everything out of it, but it's got lots of parts in it here. Because <laughs> I'm afraid I'm gonna lose something in this car. It's got the little microphone, everything. It's got a light. But I have really been getting different things to try. The thing about Timu is everything is so affordable on there for the most part that you can, if you want to kind of experiment with something, even if you want to experiment with it before you go out and buy a more expensive item that you think you might need. I know nothing about all this stuff, so I just thought I would try a couple things on Timu just to kind of see how it works out. And there's so much content that I want to start bringing to you guys. And so I've got like... A whole idea notebook of things I'm gonna I'm wanting to do eventually on this channel so that's what I got that for this next item was four dollars and 89 cents socks you get looks like five pair and if you guys saw the haul where I showed you those really pretty colorful socks I just got I told you I would get a, a short version this is the short version of those I just think these are so pretty so there's the burgundy ones well somewhat burgundy and orange and then there's the green. This is the um, style of sock I wear most of the time. But um, I've been getting colder. I, I'm very hot nature generally. But I've been getting colder. So I got some of those taller ones. Um, so I'm sure I will wear all of these at some point. Here's a pair. But I thought they're nice and thick. Wonderful quality. Definitely worth the money. I mean, yeah, they're nice. So five pairs of those for the $4.89. And like I said, they're very similar to the taller ones I showed you in one of my last Timu hauls. Okay, y'all, on to the next item. This next item I just think is beautiful. They were 97 cents. They sort of look like, um, kind of like a snowflake. And one thing I do want to tell you about Timu, because you know a lot of times their packages come in smashed. Now I will tell you their customer service is amazing. But oh, it was like something fell. It was a sticker. Um, or the hole punch maybe. But these are beautiful. But one thing I will tell you is when stuff comes in smashed, some, I've had these the backs like this all bent up that have broken off. So keep that in mind. Watch those if you're not wearing them right away when you get them in to make sure they're not damaged. But this is them. They are absolutely beautiful. Rhinestones in them, just beautiful. And they just look like little snowflakes. And I paid 97 cents for them. Okay, y'all, this next item was $1.43. You guys, I had to get this. Some of you have mailed me cards with these stickers on, so you are going to remember those of you who have sent them in. But I think it's so cute. It says, warning, open this package will cause extreme, opening this package will cause extreme happiness. You get a total of 120 stickers for $1.43. Aren't these adorable? Let's show you up close. I was going to pull them out, and I'm like, well, they're all the same, so I can show you one up close, and you can see what it looks like. Okay. Next item was $7.59. Now this is sterling silver. So it was a little you know, more expensive. Doing my hair today made me realize just how badly I really need a haircut. Okay, it comes in this cute little box. Now I didn't get it because of this box. This is something for me. But I wanted to show it to you in case you want to get it as a gift. It says... Dear, I have finally found you across the ocean. Sorry, it's foiled. I can hardly see it. Now, I already belong to you. I wish you happy every day. Maybe I am not the most perfect one, but I hope to become more perfect in you. Thank you. 
So there's just a cute little gift box if you wanted to give this as a gift. I got this for myself. Um, I just think it was so pretty. It's a spoon ring. If you guys have never heard of a spoon ring, they're made out of spoon handles. And I have gotten a few over the years that I've purchased like at um, antique stores, that kind of thing. But I just think they're beautiful. And I fell in love with this one. I actually got it to wear on my thumb. But um, it has little crosses on it. I don't know if you guys can see that in the video. And flowers. So pretty. I just think it's gorgeous. And it is sterling silver. So it should hold up pretty good. I'm going to put it on my thumb to kind of show you. And, you know, you can kind of bend it to fit your finger. But that's what I got it for. I just love it. And when I saw it on their site, I was like, oh, I love spoon rings. I want to get one of those. So <laughs> got that. And I was happy that it did come in the sterling silver. So should be pretty durable. Okay, let me put this back in its bag. And like I said, that was $7.59. So how is everybody doing today? Y'all, I'm not even going to lie to you. I have been very unproductive. <laughs> I woke up early this morning. It was like a little after four. And I wake up even on my off days very early. And um, I woke up. And I just. I wasn't feeling bad. I just felt tired. Like I didn't feel sick or anything. I just felt worn out. And I was like, oh, I don't want to get up yet. But I just kept laying there. And I'm somebody I hate to waste time. Like. When I can be doing something productive. So I was like, I just need to get up. So I got up and went to the living room. It's on the couch and it's just kind of laying there. And I was like, okay. So I, I'm diabetic. I mentioned to that guy, to that, to you guys before. But for those of you who don't know, I am a diabetic. And I take um, a pill form of medication, but I also take a weekly injection. So... I was like, when the day that I take the injection, I try to spread out my pills because I take so many in the morning, the injection kind of midday, and then I take the last pill in the evening before I go to bed. So I was like, I need to eat earlier so that I don't, so it's all kind of space out better than what I would normally do with just my pills. So I uh, went ahead and thought, what can I fix? You know, I was kind of hungry. I wasn't starving, but I was like, I could eat. I made some peach oatmeal and it was delicious. So I got that going and set and ate and watched a little TV. And then I just suddenly felt very, very tired. <laughs> More so than what I already was. So I thought, I'm just going to lay on the couch for a few minutes, rest my eyes. And yeah, I fell asleep, you guys. <laughs> I didn't get up until like 7.30. So there you have it. I just, I got nothing accomplished after I woke up early. Okay, this next item was $2.78. I'm not going to be able to show it to you very well because it's a blow-up item. Basically what it is, is it's reindeer antlers, I guess you would say. And you blow this up. It's a, it's a blow-up. You blow it up. This is the antlers. So it's hard to show it to you, but you put it on your head and it has like a ring around it with the antlers sticking out. You put it on your head, then you blow up these rings, these, and when you blow them up, it's a tossing game. You're trying to toss them to your partner across the way onto their antlers, if that makes sense. So I thought this would be a fun thing to blow up and take to my dad's house. We celebrate Christmas, Christmas Eve with all the family. Well, not all the family, but with my brother and his kids, my one sister Alicia and her kids when, they, when they're when they able to come, they're grown. And um, my brother's kids are younger. Um, and then my dad and then my family. So um, my one sister lives in Connecticut, so she doesn't usually get to come home for Christmas Eve, but we've always celebrated on Christmas Eve. And so we will be driving to my dad's for that. And since I didn't get to go to my brother's for Thanksgiving, well, I've never missed Christmas Eve, but um, we will definitely be going for that. So I wanted to take some different games this year than what I normally have. So I decided to find some stuff on Timu. So you guys, I've shown you a few of the games that I've picked up so far. So that's one of them that's going with me. And I just thought that would be fun. I almost feel like you need a second one. So like you can both have them on and then like you one do it and then the other one do it kind of thing. 
So I might order a second one so it's just easier so you're not having to take it off. And I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know. Okay. This next item was $9.36. And this is a set of two bras. Now, y'all, I purchased bras on Timu before. And the quality was excellent, but I couldn't get the right sizing. So I did send them back. Well, these look so comfortable, and um, I thought, I'm going to give those a go. So they're supposed to be a, a t-shirt style bra, you know, for to wear under t-shirts, since that's what I wear most of the time. But these seem so nice. I mean, look at this stretchy band in the back. It feels, the material is amazing. And I, I really can't get over how good the quality seems. I'm going to show it to you this way. So I think it's really nice. Now, I always wear an underwire. These do not have underwires, and I'm kind of wanting some that don't have the underwire. As I'm getting older, I just, I'm kind of not wanting to deal with the underwire. But you got a set of two bras for the 936. So I got that uh, beige color, taupe, whatever you want to call it, and a black one. So I'm going to give these a try. I will let you guys know how well they fit and all that kind of stuff after I, after I try them on. I was able to get... So I need about a, um, I'm plus size, I need about a 44C. So I will let y'all know, know how those work out. Okay, but for that price for two bras, I pay a lot of money for bras. So I think you can't beat that. Okay, this next item, y'all, these are so funny to me because they are so much tinier than what I anticipated they would be. They are small. They're meant to be small. But um, you get a set of 12 of these for $2.96. So I always make bunt cakes all the time. I have a bunt pan. I've never made the, like, mini ones, the small ones. So I ordered these off of their site. Get that out of there. Okay. Like I said, you get 12 for $2.96. And this is them. This is how little they are. So, I mean, I think they'll be fine. I think they would be good to make, like, these little minis for, like, um, if you do, like, multiple desserts. I thought this would be fun to, like, make little minis. I make a bundt cake that's made with orange juice. It's, like, it's delicious. And then powdered, um, I started to say powdered syrup. No, it's not powdered syrup powdered sugar. <laughs> anyway, you sprinkle it on top, but I thought, I wonder if I could make that in these. I mean, I guess I could just make the recipe and just pour it in these. I, I don't know, you guys. Let me know if you know anything about baking in little mini cups, because I do not, but I'm going to give it a go and see, if, see how it works out. So you do get 12. You get basically three of each of these colors. So there's a gray, kind of a, in between a beige and a pastel pink color. And then you get um, the red and then this pretty aqua blue color. So we're going to try it. We're going to see how it works out. I mean, they were definitely affordable, so we'll give it a go and see how they how they work. This next item is a gift for Gracie. It's for her Christmas stocking, y'all. She's got so many toys. Oh, my gosh. She saw me pricing last night, and she saw these toys, and, and I know she knew what they were. She kept coming up, sticking her nose in my bag. I'm like... Nope, there's nothing in there for you. <laughs> this is something for her. It was $3.97. I had to get it because it was a gingerbread man dog toy. <laughs> She's going to love this so much. So this is one of her stocking Christmas gifts. I just did a stocking for the animals, each of them. The cat, he's not much for playing. It's funny. What he wants to play with is like a bread tie. Isn't that weird? <laughs> But I'm always afraid, like, will he choke on that? Will he? So I'll watch him play with it for, like, a few minutes. And then, like, I take it away from him because I'm not. I'm always worried he'll, something will happen. Okay, this next item was $6.37. Now, this is 60 pieces of tissue paper. I am not overly impressed with this when I can buy, like, a good chunk at Dollar Tree for $1.25. So I think they are only 20 sheets, and these are folded in half, but this is not at all impressive to me. So I may end up sending this back because I don't think it's really a good value for the money. You guys, let me know what you guys think. 
So I can get those 20 sheets at Dollar Tree for $1.25. I was really expecting it to be like big sheets. And even though it's folded in half, they're still not big. Okay, this next item was $1.98. The great thing about Timu is if you don't like something or if anything's damaged or anything like that, they will, you can return it. There's no questions. There's no problem at all. So I highly recommend their customer service is amazing. Next item, this is another gift for Gracie. Yes, y'all. I'm obsessed with dog toys. It's <laughs> ninety eight, And it says nice on it. And then, you know I had to have them both. You guys know, I had to have them both. She can't have one without the other. And this one says, also $1.98. Naughty. So I had to get them both for her because, you know, it is what it is. She just had to have them. Okay, y'all. And the very last item. Oh, no. There's two more items. Sorry. The next item was $1.79. And I showed you guys my, um, you know I love the Golden Girls, but I also love the Gilmore Girls, that TV show. And um, I got the Gilmore Girls coffee mug that I showed you guys. One of the most recent hauls I've had. Well, Y'all, I found stickers. Gilmore Girls stickers. So, if you've ever watched the show, one of the things was they the guy that owned the little coffee shop did not allow you to have your cell phone in his shop. He hated technology. So, um, this is one of the things. One of the stickers. It says no cell phones. And then it was Luke's Diner. And the main character loves to read. So she's always got a book with her all the time. Usually multiple books. And her and her mother, her mother more so than her, had to have coffee every day. <laughs> all the time. And if you have ever seen the show, this was one of the episodes. And what this means is ready for anything. Is my understanding of it. There was a gazebo that they always went to, and it was always decorated for all the different holidays, which I loved. Like, if y'all have never seen this show, and if you're, like, a, a Hallmark junkie like me, but, like, with really fun wit and humor, definitely watch Gilmore Girls. It's usually on Netflix or one of those streaming options. Um, Dosey's Market, this is the grocery store in the, in the show. It is the kind of town that I would love to live in. Like if it was a real place. Or I should say if the real place was like that. Dragonfly Inn is what um, the mom of the main character, um, the business that she runs. This is the grandma on the show. Love this actress. She's amazing. Oh, I'm seeing the post office person. I did run to my actual P.O. box this morning, but there were no more cards in there. It says, I'm the Roy to your Lorelei. Roy is the main character of the daughter, and Lorelei is the mom. Must have not got any more packages today because she didn't pull in the driveway. And this is the song, the main, uh, I don't know if you can see those words, Where You Lead, I Will Follow. It's the song that they play. In the show. So it's just lots of great stickers. You get like 50 of them in here. I'm not going to show you anymore. But um, I love this show. I was so happy to find this. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with them yet. I might do like a Gilmore Girl kind of junk journal. At some point. Just because I think that would be a lot of fun. I would love to actually go. They say. I, I believe it's in Connecticut. I know that's where it's. Um supposed to be at as far as the show um but i think in the actual real life i think in connecticut they do have some kind of gift shop or, or something that you can go there and do for the gilmore girls show because it was so popular okay next item um this is something i wanted to see if it was like the real deal because timu you know does a lot of um dupes that kind of stuff but y'all i found this it says command brand 
um, I found these command strips. And it says 3M up here on the site, but it's in, like, I don't know what language this is, if it's Chinese or if it's something else. But So I thought I'm going to grab some and see how well they work because these were, these were $3.59. And then I got a price adjustment on them of like a dollar something. So they it made them pretty, really affordable. I didn't know I was getting that. I was just getting them to try. But y'all, and those price adjustments, I just have to tell you again about them. If you're not doing it, you need to make sure you are. Now, I will tell you, I get a lot of price adjustments because I have a lot of orders. So you go through each order to check to see if there are any available. If that doesn't make sense to you comment and I will try to explain it in the next video a little bit better um but um I did want to say that like yesterday now keep in mind I've had a lot of shipping I don't want to say issues but my shipping has been late a lot on my orders I live out in the country I can tell you the last several months almost every order has come in late um and that's one of the reasons well one because I work a crazy work schedule it's never the same but two, I never know when my Timu is going to show up with them because it'll tell me it's out for delivery and it won't show up. So I don't know if that's a post office thing or a Timu thing, but you know, Timu, if you've ever shopped on there, they give you this shipping like time frame that they ship stuff in. And mine is almost always late these last several months. Didn't used to be when they first, when I first started shopping with them, I got it pretty quick. But that's not the case anymore. However, I will say they give you a $5 credit when it's past that date frame that they allow. So last week, I told you guys I had those huge ones. Um, this week, I got two $5 credits for two packages being late so far. And then I got, I want to say in adjustments, I want to say it was like, well... By the time it was all said and done, my credit was like, so $10 of, $10 of the credit was from the things being late. But then I had like another $9 and something in price adjustments. So $19 and something and some change. Y'all, I just put that money back into Timu. You know, they give it to me and then I can go on there and order some more stuff. Um, usually as long as you spend $10 or more, your shipping is free. So a lot of times I'll have small hauls like this and a lot of them are from me doing those adjustment orders, only buying a few things at a time, but they're always $10 or more, so I get the free shipping. So it's worth it for me to do that. And a lot of times it's money I've earned. So super excited about that. I want to make sure you guys are getting what's owed to you. Um, this time of year, especially every little bit helps. But um, that is it for this Timu haul. Now, y'all, we are going to jump right in to day five of the 12 Days of Christmas drawings. So let me get the envelopes in here. Let me get them all mixed up. I had them loose in this bag. I pulled them out to put the merchandise on top of them. But now it's all in my seat. I just want to get them in the bag so that I can mix them all up good. one I had to make sure okay let me pull one out I gotta make sure I don't show you guys his addresses okay this is the back of the envelope if you know you know you know which who sent that in and I'm gonna open it up this person is Angela and Angela and her daughter Melody I remember this one beautiful card they're from Texas this is the card that they sent So, Angela, you can be expecting a um, package from me. Merry Christmas. Congratulations. Love this card. I think it's absolutely beautiful. And she did the beautiful sticker with the angels. So, congratulations, Angela. I'm so excited you won. Um, guys, I had packages that went out this morning. So, you guys, you should start seeing that stuff showing up at your house. Um, we've already sent a few things, but I know that shipping is taking like an extra long time. I don't know what's going on with that. I haven't heard from any of you guys that you received your packages yet. So sometimes I never hear from anybody, but if you want to share that with me, I would love to know. I just, I was worried that it didn't show up, but I do keep a tracking 
sticker for each thing that I ship, so I know whether you got it or not. I check periodically, but I haven't checked since I started sending this group of stuff out. So I need to get those stickers out and look to see if they're if they're headed your way or not yet. Alrighty, y'all, that is it for today. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day, a great week. Um, I'm always kind of thrown off a bit because my days are always different. Sometimes it's a weekend, sometimes it's through the week when I'm off. So in the middle of the week, I'm like, what day is it? Like, what's everybody doing? So I hope you guys are having a good week. It is Tuesday today. I had to think about that. But um, I am so excited. It is a little chilly today. I wouldn't say cold. Really. I mean, it's it's nice for like a sweatshirt. Oh, I wanted to show you guys today's sweatshirt I'm wearing. So y'all, I don't know if you remember this sweatshirt, but it says... And sometimes I say these wrong on camera because I can't see them on the camera. I read them wrong. God is great. I can see that part. It's big letters. Chickens are good. Here's the chickens. And people are crazy. <laughs> I saw this and I love, love, love this sweatshirt. It is a hoodie, so it does have a hood on it. I'm not a huge fan of hoodies, of hats. I don't, I mean, of the on the back. I don't necessarily, I don't dislike them. I just... If I'm going to get a sweatshirt, most of the time I buy the ones that don't have hoods. But um, I love this sweatshirt. Love it. And it is, for those of you who always ask about the clothing, it is a very soft material. It is a polyester blend. It is a vinyl iron-on, in case you wanted to know that. Um, and I have washed it once. And like I said, I don't dry them, so I did hang it up to dry. And when I washed it, I put it inside out. So... Nothing cracked, nothing, no issues at all. So just wanted to let you know that. I'm going to start doing that on all the clothing if I've washed it so I can kind of give you guys a heads up as to how it's how it's wearing, how it's washing kind of thing. Okay, y'all, that is it for today. Again, I hope you're having a fabulous week, and I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm excited because tonight, if it doesn't rain, there it's very cloudy today, overcast, they're talking about possible rain, 15% chance or something. If it doesn't rain, Jack and I are going to go see the Christmas lights. I love the Christmas lights. It's like my favorite part of Christmas. And we have like two different places, but it's two different towns we go to. So I'm hoping we go to the one that's closer to us tonight because it's the better one of the two. But we're still going to go to the other one on another night. So I'll be sharing that with y'all um, if I can. I don't know how well my camera is going to work at night to do that, but I'm going to give it a go and try. So... Um, I'm going to try to tape that so I can share that stuff with you guys. Okay, be blessed, and I'll see y'all tomorrow. Bye.